Straka. I am a junior concept artist at Industrial Light and Magic. I kind of grew up with like, oh, you could be an animator when you grow up. That was mostly the only thing I knew that people could do like as an artistic career, like drawing. I kind of graduated from wanting to be an animator to uh, finding a lot of other art out in the world. Concept art for film and video games. That really opened the world up for me. Everything that you see on screen in a movie, especially a VFX heavy movie, needs to be designed. We need to figure it out ahead of time what it's gonna look like. I'm part of a team that does that at ILM. So I can design anything from like a character or a creature, uh, or sometimes an environment or a prop, and sometimes even storyboards. A lot of the time, it might be something you only see in passing, and sometimes it could be like an entire character design that was finalized and ended up being like the look of something or someone on screen. I've been doing a lot of VR boarding and it's, it's all for first person, so it is a lot of boarding out like the action of stuff that's happening around you. You can figure out how things are going to move like in the space so that the person in VR can see everything. One of the great things about working in this industry, I think, is you get challenged all the time. Every day you are challenged and you get to grow from that every day. Some challenges that I faced are like on a more personal level, like coming out of my shell more, which I still work on, and kind of getting over like the fear of critique, which every artist struggles with. And then some other challenges I face are just trying to improve with stuff and learning new tools. I fail at work all the time, and I don't mean that in like a bad way. You fail all the time and you have to learn from it. Production environment is extremely fast paced. The biggest piece of advice I could give to somebody who's just starting out in the industry is that you have to be resilient. Some productions move and change day to day and you, you won't know if something that you got finaled yesterday is going to get scrapped the next or if everything's gonna run smooth through the whole thing. Never, you can never predict that. Work smarter, not harder. I think with a lot of artists just in general, there's a lot of the conceit that you have to like work hard, you work hardest and almost suffer for your craft. I don't think that's true. <laughs> I think that wastes a lot of time. I think that you are better served by finding out how to make the tools work for you, uh, put in a lot of practice and find shortcuts that help you get something done fast and still look good. I haven't the faintest idea why I agreed to this. I must be malfunctioning. Get in the door.